the book won tons of awards. The London stage adaptation racked up seven Olivier Awards, and now the curious incident of The Dog in the Nighttime has landed on Broadway beginning this fall at the Ethel Barrymore Theater. What makes this story so gripping? We're here at their Midtown rehearsal space to solve the mystery. I gotta know, what is The Curious Incident all about? Tell me about that. Well, a dog was murdered with a pitchfork. So a 15-year-old boy, a young boy, uh, has to solve the crime. And his teacher tells him that he should write a book about his detective work. And he's a kind of peculiar guy, Christopher. What are some of the, you know, kind of interesting things that he does? Well, he doesn't like to be touched. Um, he's very particular about that. He doesn't like brown, the color brown. He doesn't like yellow. Uh, he doesn't like loud noises. But on the same hand, he's so particular and has such strong visceral responses to such things. He's also uh, adores space and is absolutely obsessed with it. He could tell you anything about space. The, the main thing about the book and also the stage play is that it's really about telling the story from his point of view. So the book, as the book is written from his point of view, so the play we've set out to tell it, everything that happens on the stage is through the lens of Christopher, how he would see it. I really loved his um, wit. He's a very funny character. And I loved the way that he uh, was so refreshing in his uh, view of things. So it's a very delightful read. It's a beautiful character. It's his struggles with that and, and his perseverance is, is so inspiring throughout. Like his, his, he sees the goal and he pursues it and he, he gets there in the end. Maybe. We have to come and see it. Why do we need a good mystery on Broadway right now? We want to solve the crime, don't we? I mean, yeah, we want to know what happened. We want to, we want to figure it out. And it's also really exciting to be led through a mystery by a mind like Christopher's, who's this genius. I think people live with the sense that secretly we know, we know we're capable of being heroic. And the story is a celebration of bravery and heroism in the most unlikely of circumstances. So I want to know from you, is it really as great as everybody says? Oh, it's fantastic. I mean, it's, it's uh, you know, we've, we've only just begun and the play is moving and it's, and it's complex and it's filled with real people and then the production is spectacular and magical and, and I, I think, you know, it gets really close to what it would be like to enter another person's mind. The experience that audiences have with the curious incident of the dog in the night time, you can't get in the movies you can't get on television, you can't even really get in the novel. It's a unique celebration of the remarkable things that people are capable of. Nobody's just a good guy or a bad guy. Um, there's, there's great range and it's very honest, it's very real. It's like you're, you're in for a, a special ride when you, when you come to the show.